Hello everyone, this is me Vandana Manoj. Welcome to Enjoy Learning English. Today I have come up with some common mistakes. These mistakes are made by adding S to some words. And these group of words are known as zero plurals. We know very clearly that if we want to make a, a particular word into plural form, singular to plural, we will be adding S, E, S or V, E, S. Then we will be getting plurals. For example, boy will become boys by adding S. And uh, what is that? Strawberry will become strawberries. And what about knife? We will be adding V, E, S. Then we will be getting knives. So that is a plural form of knife. But some group of words are there where you should not add s they remain the same they are what is that identical in singular and plural they are known as zero plurals and we should not add s that is incorrect so i'm going to tell you about those zero plurals in this session so without much ado shall we check what are those words it will start with this word this is furniture if it is one it is or singular it is furniture and if it is plural that is two or more than two it is also furniture not furnitures and if you want to specify you can say like five pieces of furniture there were five pieces of furniture in that house or you can say i bought a lot of furniture yesterday or you can say i bought five pieces of furniture yesterday not five pieces of furnitures I hope it's clear to you. So next word is this one. Information. Information is also in this category. You should not say informations. Okay. So I got a lot of information from this book. Not lot of informations. Now comes this word luggage. Luggage also comes under this category. You should not add as to this particular word. So if you want to specify, you can say like number of pieces, like five pieces of luggage. So we can say like, uh, you can ask like, how many pieces of luggage are we checked in? So how many pieces of luggage are we checked in? So never say luggages, only luggage. What about this word equipment? Equipment also comes under this category. Never add S to this particular word. So we can say, uh, if I want to make this thing, we need a lot of equipment, not equipments. Okay. Or you can say, I need a, a number of equipment. Never say a number of equipments. Then comes this word. What about this one? Staff also comes under this category. So there are a lot of staff in my company or we can say 100 uh, staff are in my company so you can say like staff only never add s to this particular word and what about this word it's tough it also comes under this category you should not add s over here so you can say his room was filled with a lot of stuff and i didn't like it so it is like what uh, stuff not stuffs never say his room was filled with a lot of stuffs that's wrong it is only stuff what about this word aircraft this is also a zero plural you should not add s to get the plural form of it in sentence we can say like these aircraft are made in brazil never say that these aircrafts that's wrong now comes another word advice to this word also you should not add s for example stephen gave me some good advice and you should not say stephen gave me some good advices that's wrong now comes a list of some animals these animal names are also under this category that is zero plurals for example we'll start with this word that is fish if it is plural we should use only fish and never say fishes for example we can say i saw many fish in that pond never say many fishes that's wrong and what about this word it is swine so that is also in this category you should not add s to get the plural and this is also bison you should not add s to get the plural form of bison what about this one it's sheep it also comes under this one and you should not add yes over here so if you want to specify you can say i say a flock of sheep over there what about this one this is deer deer is also in this category you should not say deers you sh it's it's only what deer in plural so we can say like i saw many deer in that park I saw many deer in that park. Never say I saw many deers. That's wrong. 
So that's it. I hope you have entered this mini session with common mistakes by adding s to some particular words. So never repeat those mistakes again. And uh, before winding up, please let me know which all words were new to you. And please put it in the comment box and I'll be waiting for it. So next time I'll be coming with another interesting video. Until then, it's bye from Vandana.